Good day once again. My name is Graphics. Today we want to draw an equator triangle and draw the escaping circle of that triangle. Now when you say we have then three categories. We have inscribe. Inscribe is when the circle is inside the triangle. Right? When you draw a circle inside the triangle, you say you are inscribing. When you say circumscribe, when the circle is outside the triangle, right? Now we have a scribe. A scribe is when the circle is what? Is outside the circle such that one side of the circle is touching one of the, the part of the circle of the circle is touching one side of what? The triangle. Right? So let's see how we'll do that. Now the question goes like this. It says Construct an equilateral triangle with sides 75 mm and a scribe. Now, the first thing you do, you take your T square, you draw an horizontal line, faint line first of all, right? Then you choose a point. Let me say I'm taking this point here, right? Now, let's say that is my point A. And I'll take my compass. Since it's said it's an equilateral triangle, that means all the sides are equal. And I'm going to measure. 40 75 so if i'm starting from here i'll start from one and i'll end at 85 but if i'm starting from zero i'll end at what 75 so if I'm starting from one i'll end at what 85 right that will be 75 now i'll place it at my point a here start again and i'll strike an arc to get my point b so this is what this is my point b and this is also my point a and i'll take it to b i'll strike another arc up like this and i'll come at this point a also I'll strike another part up so where they meet will be what my point c all right so i'm going to join a b and c together and i'll thicken it so I'll join A, B, and C together, and I'm going to thicken it. And I'm going to thicken it. All right. So this is my equilateral triangle because all the sides are equal. Now I want to draw an describing circle on it. So what I'm going to do is. I am going to extend this man here, right? I will extend this man here. If you look at what I'm doing, I'm going to extend him. You can just reduce it a little bit, that's what I'm talking about. So I'm going to extend him, right? And also, this is already extended. Is that again? So, or I extend it further. To this point. Now I'll take my compass at any given radius, maybe a radius of 10 or any radius of my choice, and I'll place it at this point B. Let me show you to see what I'm talking about. I'll place it at what point B, and I'm going to draw an arc this way. I see the arc now. I also come to point C. I'll do the same thing too. I'll draw an arc. Sorry. Point C. I'll draw an arc. Cutting this way. You can see. Now let's see where the arc cuts the horizontal part here is called B1. And when it cuts this triangle here is called what? B2. Where the arc cuts this triangle here, we'll call it C1. I will it cut here, we call it what? C2. I will together now. Now, I will now extend my my compass a little bit. Maybe 30 millimeter. And I'll place it at B1. I'll place it at B1. I'll strike an arc. I'll place it at B2. I'll strike the other arc. So, where it meets, I'm going to draw my triangle, my line, that will pass through the center here. Wait, wait. 
Then I'll draw my straight line like this. You can see that? I'll go to the next point to the same radius. I'll place at C1. I'll strike an arc. I'll go to C2. I'll also strike another arc this way. Are we good? So, where they meet, I'll draw a line that will pass through the center. This way. To cut the other guy here. So this is my center here. And I will form the center of what? Of my cycle. Of my circle, right? So what I'm going to do here is, let's go back. I'll place my compass at the center and I'm going to take it to touch the circumference of my to touch the side of my triangle where I want to draw my scribing circle and this is what I'll be having. So place it here and I'll adjust it to this point. The circumference of the circle. I mean the side of the triangle. Hope you can see that. Then I'm going to now draw my scribing circle. Right. So, so I'll have this. So, this is what you will be having, right? So it must be tangential to all the sides of the circle, of the lines, it must touch through, and you must thicken it, right? So, this is what we are talking about, the describing circle of the triangle thanks for watching and if you know if you benefited from this video don't forget to click on the subscribe button